name is Tony Robles, TNN TV, that's PNN, not CNN. We are here at the Paulo Mejia Art Gallery and Design Studio in San Francisco, located at 4343B, 3rd Street, in the Bayview. We're here to uh, an art opening, an art exhibit called Quintessential Adobo. Now, for those of you who have eaten adobo, you know adobo is thick, it's good, it's tasty, it's like a story. We're going to find out about the stories and the thick flavors of the art that's being made by the artist Mel Vera Cruz. So why don't we go inside? Check it out. All right, and this is the art gallery. This is Mel Vera Cruz, the, uh, the, the artist uh, whose uh, art we are uh, exhibiting uh, at the uh, gallery. And you got to tell us, our, our audience, for PNL TV, quintessential adobo. What was the inspiration behind uh, the, uh, the name? Uh, you know, adobo is a uh, uh, staple Filipino food, and uh, it's uh, it's not really, I mean, uh, mainstream because of smell, because of the uh, the vinegar, you know, and the smoke with the vinegar is bad. So, uh, and. Uh, um, but I'd like to present it as, uh, you know, like, uh, don't be, uh, be shy about it or something like that. And present it with uh, pride because actually the vinegar is uh, what makes the adobo last for days without uh, refrigeration. So it's a main ingredient to make it last. So I think uh, my show is also about that, my mentality. It's, uh, it's like uh, my mind is still uh, sharp, even in like uh, murky water. Yeah, so uh, because it's built on like a vinegar, like a yeah. solid foundation. So I think it's like uh, similar. 